K218b. A new chapter in the search for life a new frontier in the search for life beyond Earth has opened. As you gaze into the infinite night sky, sprinkled with billions of shimmering stars, one question arises with timeless persistence. Are we alone in the universe? For centuries, philosophers, astronomers, and dreamers have pondered this. And now, thanks to groundbreaking technology, humanity may finally be approaching an answer. This leap forward comes through the James Webb Space Telescope, or JWST. Launched to see deeper and more clearly into the cosmos than ever before, JWST acts as a cosmic magnifying glass, capturing faint light that has traveled hundreds, even thousands, of years across space. Recently, JWST focused on a distant and mysterious world, K218b. This exoplanet resides in the constellation Leo, approximately 120 light-years from Earth. At first glance, it might appear to be just another distant planet, but detailed observations revealed something extraordinary. A unique world K218b belongs to a class known as sub-Neptunes, planets larger than Earth but smaller than Neptune. This category doesn't exist in our solar system making K218b both fascinating and puzzling. Standard comparisons like Earth, Mars, Jupiter, or Saturn do not apply here. Sub-Neptunes are, in between worlds, neither fully rocky nor fully gaseous, creating both scientific intrigue and mystery. And K218b quickly caught astronomers' attention for one reason in particular, the potential for life. The planet orbits a red dwarf star named K218 at just 0.18 astronomical units, far closer than Earth is to the Sun. For comparison, Mercury orbits our Sun at 0.39 astronomical units. Yet K218b isn't scorched. Red dwarfs, though sometimes active, are much cooler and dimmer than our Sun. This places K218b in the habitable zone, where temperatures may allow liquid water to exist under certain atmospheric conditions. JWST detected precisely that water vapor in K218b's atmosphere, a finding that electrified the scientific community. Signs of life? Water alone is not proof of life. Scientists also examine atmospheric chemistry for potential biosignatures. Using advanced spectroscopic techniques, JWST detected methane and carbon dioxide, both naturally occurring on Earth and other planets. But the most intriguing discovery was a molecule rarely found outside biological processes, dimethyl sulfide, DMS. On Earth, DMS is produced exclusively by microorganisms in oceans. It influences cloud formation and acts as a chemical indicator of life. If its presence on K218b is confirmed, it would represent the strongest biosignature ever detected beyond our solar system. While K218b likely does not host forests or civilizations, at least not as we know them, its environment may be suitable for microbial life. The discovery of DMS, pending further confirmation, makes K218b the most promising exoplanet candidate for life to date. High in Worlds A new planetary class to understand why K218b is so significant, we must explore a new planetary concept, High in Worlds. Astrophysicist Niku Madhusudan proposed these in 2021, describing water-rich planets covered by a thick hydrogen-dominated atmosphere. High-end worlds can be up to 10 times the mass of Earth and twice its radius. Unlike gas giants like Jupiter, they are oceanic planets under a hydrogen blanket, allowing liquid water to persist even at distances where Earth-like planets would freeze. In some cases, these oceans could account for up to 90% of the planet's mass. Such environments may support life, even under extreme conditions, similar to Earth's extremophiles that thrive in hydrothermal vents or acidic lakes. K218b may be one of these high-end worlds.
Its size makes it easier to detect, and its atmosphere allows habitable conditions over a wider range of distances from its star, potentially even up to 200 degrees Celsius, 392 degrees Fahrenheit, in deep oceans. How JWST observed K218b JWST used transit spectroscopy, observing K218b as it passed in front of its star. Starlight filtered through the planet's atmosphere revealed the chemical fingerprints of molecules present. From just five hours of observations over two sessions, JWST detected water vapor carbon dioxide methane tentative traces of DMS. These molecules together suggest an environment capable of supporting life, even if only microbial. What comes next? The journey continues. The discoveries at K218b are nothing short of remarkable. Yet scientists urge caution. While the tentative detection of dimethyl sulfide, DMS, hints at possible biological activity, confirmation is still required. Further observations will be crucial to verify these findings, refine measurements, and explore the planet's atmospheric composition in greater detail. Understanding how molecules like water vapor, methane, carbon dioxide, and DMS interact under K218b's unique environmental conditions will be key to unlocking its potential for life. But even in this early stage, K218b is already challenging our assumptions about where life might exist. For decades, we have largely focused on Earth-like planets, within narrow habitable zones, with familiar climates and conditions. K218b tells a different story, one in which life could survive, even thrive, in worlds vastly different from our own. Its dense hydrogen-rich atmosphere, combined with vast oceans and potentially temperate climates beneath the surface, demonstrates that habitable environments can take forms we never imagined. If high-end worlds like K218b are common across the galaxy, the implications are staggering. The sheer number of planets capable of supporting life, particularly microbial life, could be far greater than previously estimated. Our search for life must expand beyond traditional Earth analogs to include these extreme yet life-friendly environments. The universe is more diverse, more inventive, and far more capable of nurturing life than we have dared to assume. Future telescopes, missions, and instruments will play a crucial role in this exploration. Spectroscopic surveys, direct imaging, and even next-generation space probes could eventually reveal the true nature of K218b and its counterparts. Each new observation will deepen our understanding of planetary formation, atmospheric chemistry, and the conditions required for life to emerge. Every measurement brings us closer to answering one of humanity's oldest questions. Are we alone in the universe? As we contemplate these possibilities, it is important to remember that K218b is more than a distant point of light in the sky. It is a window into the unknown, a reminder that our universe is vast, dynamic, and full of surprises waiting to be discovered. It challenges us to think differently, to look beyond the familiar, and to expand the very definition of what it means for a planet to be habitable. The journey is far from over. K218b is only the beginning, a spark that will inspire generations of scientists, explorers, and dreamers. New discoveries will continue to reshape our understanding of life in the cosmos, revealing environments both alien and awe-inspiring. Each exoplanet we study, each spectrum we analyze, is a step toward a broader cosmic perspective, a journey that will redefine humanity's place among the stars. If you've enjoyed exploring the mysteries of K218b, stay engaged, stay curious, and continue this journey with us. Like, share, and subscribe for more deep dives into the wonders of the cosmos. Join the conversation in the comments, what do you imagine we might uncover next? Because the universe is waiting. And as K218b shows us, it is full of possibilities that go beyond imagination.